Hey guys, thank you so much for everything that you've done. Subscribing, we're almost to 100 subscribers. We're gonna be giving out our marks to 10 subscribers. Comment, I am subscribed, and we'll give you some merch for free. And thank you. Let's get back to the video. Hey guys. Ready to go fishing? Yeah. I'm no homework. Good day to use my no homework test. Oh, he's getting chased. Oh, he's getting chased. Oh, gosh. Come on, mate. Gosh, it's like 15. Ooh, a little baby bass ate it. I saw that. Water's crystal clear. Oh. Oh, my God. Okay, no drip. Here we go, Lou. Oh, my baby is big. Oh, this is what I wanted. There we go. Nice little peacock. Okay. Nice. See you, buddy. Luke's using the shiners, and Daddy's gonna try to get one with a fluke. A little DOA fluke. See, look at this peacock. Let's see if I can get him to bite. Oh, ho, ho, you whacked at it. I guess. There's a little 40 in back. A little large mouth. Ooh, there's another nice peacock right here. Let's see. There's a big one, Luke, right here in the middle. I just oh, saw, yeah. oh, there's a lot of them over there. You're gonna get one in one second. Also, YouTube, I'm testing out, first time using a polarized oh, yes, lens, so let's see oh, if it yes, works. Dad. See if we can see through the water better than normal. Yeah, Move it around a little bit. Oh yeah. Yeah. Lift it up and put it right on top of them, Luke. Hold on a second, Luke. I got an idea. Let's see. Hold on. Wait a sec. Pull it up for one sec. I got an idea. All right, guys. I'm going to tell you why you need to be fishing for peacock bass right now if you live in South Florida. At the time of this video, it's mid-May, and that means the peacock bass spawn is in full swing. These fish begin to spawn in the springtime when the water warms up, and they'll continue to spawn through the summer. But the best time to fish for them is at the beginning of the spawn around April, May, and June. Now what you're going to want to look for as a fisherman is the bedding areas and they're going to be easy to spot because they're going to be a small, circular, flat, empty space, usually with a sand or a rock bottom. And they get this way because the peacocks use their tail to clear out these small areas of any vegetation. As you can see in this video, there's going to be grass everywhere, but in that small area, it's going to be totally clean. Now the best part about the spawn is how aggressive these fish are. They will attack anything that comes near that nest. Usually the fish are a little more aggressive before the eggs hatch, but they'll still defend the nest and be really aggressive after the eggs hatch. But sometimes like this fish, this is after the eggs have hatched, you're gonna use a little more persistence. You might have to put that bait over that nest a few extra times in order to get them to commit to eating your bait. But eventually, if you're persistent, you'll get a bite. Oh, I got the hoodie. Bro, this thing has to be over. Oh, finally caught him. This thing, bro, it has to be over front. There we go. Yeah! Yeah, it took a while. He had to work for him. Nice. Bro, he goes sweet. Back where you belong. Right back to protect your nest. Nice and one. And probably catch you again. Oh, you think they get red? Who are these things? Who are them? Kabam! Okay. Yeah, that's the only big one. You're dead. No, that's the big one. Here. Yeah. Tighten it up. Get him in, Luke. Tighten that drag up. Get 
Come on, come on. There's so many, so many of them. You'll get them. Guys, if you haven't seen hmm, our other two videos that we filmed here, I caught a record peak out there. It's like ten you times. See that? Look, we both heard that. And I caught a record peak thing that was like ten times the size. Snook out here too. Ooh, it is a big one. This is not even really good. And guys, right. we won't lose this fish. We got bait. Heavy, heavy bait. So here, funny your bait was just out here and you came to the bait. And you came to my bait because it's here I got a bait. And I am the bait. You better. No, he did. Be in the bait. Well, this thing is very big. I might have to get around this. No high stick and swing him. Flip them, that's a good one. Flip them. That's a decent one. Oh, she! She's a good one. There's a couple pounds. Oh, a little baby something. Need it. Doesn't feel that baby. Oh, big tilapia? Yeah, a little one. Alright. Different species. Oh, bird, you poop on me. And it broke that thing. That thing was right under. Ted didn't even try and hook this thing. This thing was right there. I was like, oh, why not try this with my big fat dead bait? Like, okay. Oh, those weed minutes. Come on, Kevin. Yeah. Right, nice. All right. Bad, almost dinner time. Maybe one more? Yeah. Oh, there you go, that's right. I'm eating the same exact spot. Guys, I'm eight, and this is it was exactly right there. And it was still, but this time it was live, we're Same exact spot. Ooh, you just so bald. Swing him. Watch that, no high sticking, don't break that rod tip. There you go. Open that bale. Open that. Whoa, why won't my bale open? Hey. No, I can open it up. Yeah, there's a lot of big ones. There's a couple tucked up in the corner. And on the... you missed it. Where's the big one? Ooh, that is a nice one, Luke. Get him up. Tight, tight, tight. Ooh. 
Boy, I actually can't get him off. No high stick. There you go. Nice and even. Swing him nice and even right on the grass. There you go. I'm a big monster. That's a good one. Whoop! Oh, I forgot. Hey, Dad, if you want a chance. Dad, you, Dad, I'll give you a little tip. Here, Dad, there's two right there. I just caught one. I'll give you the third. Oh, a little bass to finish it off. You kidding me? <laughs> oh, 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 my bait's right there. Let me take this oven try and help my bait. You gonna swim out there and get it? Heck yeah. Alright guys, the video has to end here. Um, we're giving away 10 shirts to 10 lucky people that are subscribed. Do the comment, I am subscribed. Write that in the comment and maybe you'll be one of those lucky people that get 10 shirts.